going to be a video on how to play another Daniel Caesar song. This one's going to be Get You. Um, I'm sure you guys all know this one. But I'll be teaching the chords that he uses in all his acoustic performances. So, yeah. It's going to go something like this. So yeah, really, really cool chords that he's using. A lot of open chords for this one. So um, throughout the whole song, you're going to try to, whenever you can, leave the uh, B string and the E string open and also mute the uh, low E string. So first chord is going to be E minor 7. Sounds like that. So you're going to put your middle finger on the 7th fret of the A string. Uh, index finger on the 5th fret of the D string, and your ring finger on the 7th fret of the G string. And leave the B string and the E string open and strum it. And it goes something like this. So yeah. Really, really like that chord. So next chord is going to be, I believe this is F sharp minor 11, if my music theory is correct. So I might be wrong on that, but go something like this. So yeah, it's gonna be the exact same shape that we made before um, for E minor seven, just up two frets. So middle finger on the ninth fret of the A string this time, index finger on the seventh fret of the D string, and ring finger on the ninth fret of the G string. And of course, leave the uh, B string, E string open like that. So, so far you should have this. And the next chord is going to be um, another chord that I'm unsure of. I think this is G major 13 sus2 because you're plucking the A string as well. So it goes something like this. So you're going to put your index finger on the 5th fret of the D string, uh, middle finger on the 7th fret of the G string, and then your ring finger on the 7th fret of the B string, and then leave the E string open. Like that. So, so far it should sound like this. Next chord is going to be um, A7. So um, this shape is kind of similar to a D chord. So you're going to put your index finger on the fifth fret of the D string, um, ring finger on the sixth fret of the G string, and then your middle finger on the fifth fret of the B string. And of course, leave the E string open. So yeah, so all together, it should sound something like this. So in terms of the strumming pattern, um, feel free to use any strumming pattern that you like, um, but this is how I like to play the song. So um, it's gonna go down, 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 up, down. So this time I won't be playing the chords, but I'll have the chord shapes next to me so you guys know exactly where I'm at. So it'll go down, 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 up, down, down, up, down, 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 up, down, down, up, down, up, down, 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 up, down, down, up, down, 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 up, down, down, up, 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 down,
So all together, you should sound like this. So that's it for Daniel Caesar's Get You. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. If you want to show some love to the channel, make sure you press subscribe and the like button. Really, really does help the channel out. Um, also, let me know other songs I should teach next. Um, and other than that, y'all, stay safe, stay blessed, y'all, and uh, much love. Later.